we want to build a world-leading centre for research and knowledge exchange in oral health here at the University of Aberdeen. And for this purpose, we have a group of academics with very respected research profiles who work on themes that focus on key challenges facing oral health worldwide. And these areas include the understanding of the effect of oral health on general health, the challenges related to oral health care delivery for the elderly, the development of immunotherapy for head and neck cancer, which prevalence is higher in Scotland compared to the rest of the UK. One of the main areas of research that we focus on in head and neck cancer uh, research is cancer immunology. And we try to manipulate the immune system so that it can, can counteract cancer cells within our bodies. And uh, we have established some very good collaborations with the Institute of Medical Sciences. There's also a theme on the study of interactions between microbes and the host and how these interactions can be manipulated to develop new antimicrobial therapies, which is what I work on. Uh, in addition to that, one of the main areas of research that we look at is using digital pathology for the classification and the ease of diagnosis of different oral lesions. A further theme is innovation in dental education, which is aimed at continuously improving the learning experience of our students. We also have a growing population of postgraduate research students who benefit from the excellent learning environment here at the University of Aberdeen, as well as state-of-the-art research facilities and strong commitment to multidisciplinary research. Our research has led us to collaborate uh, at the level of the school, the level of the college, and uh, locally, nationally, and internationally. We have established collaborations within the dental school. We have established collaborations with the Institute of Medical Sciences, with the Institute of Applied Health Sciences. We have different collaborators within Scotland, within UK, within Europe, in uh, Australia, and we're looking forward to expand our research into oral cancer risk factors in Sri Lanka, in Malaysia, in uh, Europe, in addition to our uh, existing collaborators in uh, USA.